It's been a while since I've uploaded anything to YouTube, and what I've been doing is I've been making mounts for a bunch of the components that I'm putting in the car, so uh, the inverter, the charger, DC-DC converter, and stuff like that. So right here, I have the inverter for the Hyper 9 motor, which is right here. Um, and I mounted this directly to the chassis by welding on um, a piece of steel uh, channel that I cut to size. Um, and I welded that directly to the frame, the chassis frame, uh, in two places. There's one piece here, and then further back, which you can somewhat see, there's a piece right there. Uh, and I also drilled four bolt holes in it uh, to correspond with the four holes that hold the uh, inverter and the chill plate, which is right here, for the inverter in place. For the charger, I welded up this bracket, um, again with some angled steel and some flat pieces, and I have four holes in it. These four are where the charger bolts up to it, and then all these other uh, holes are how this bracket connects to the car. So, so you can see how the uh, charger mounting bracket fits in with these bolts that are original with the car um, that extrude from the firebox and then I also have the holes that I've drilled through into the area where the ECU used to be um, and that's how this thing is staying put. Here's the charger all uh, bolted up to the firewall of the car and it's very sturdily mounted. Uh, it's definitely not going anywhere. So a couple of the other things I made mounts for is the J1772 charging inlet, which fits right in here, uh, bolts into this bracket that I welded onto the front battery box, which is going where the radiator used to be. Um, so yeah, that bolts in with these four holes using these four small uh, bolts. And for the DC to DC converter, this bolts into the back of the box like this with those four uh, bolt holes.